competitive intensity in wireless has been high for a period of time. I mean, we saw uh, elevated levels of competitive intensity and promotional activity during the holiday season of 2019. And then as we came out of that initial wave uh, of COVID-19, we saw excessive promotional activity. You're starting to see the competitive environment moderate a little bit as opposed to where we were a couple of years ago. Yes, um, competitive intensity in wireless has been high for a period of time. I mean, we saw uh, elevated levels of competitive intensity and promotional activity during the holiday season of 2019. And then as we came out of that initial wave uh, of COVID-19, we saw excessive promotional activity uh, all the way through to um, the back to school season, so call it August, September, 2020. And that put a lot of pressure on the financial performance of the the wireless entities. Since then, uh, we have seen a moderation in that competitive activity, which is a good thing for the telecoms. This transaction uh, potentially assists that because historically, a lot of the promotional um, intensity has been ignited by Freedom and Shaw Wireless. They make the first move, Rogers reacts, and then right. Bell and Telus react on it on their own. So as Shaw thinks about selling to Rogers or being sold, or having wireless sold to somebody else, we're already seeing them step back. So the you know so that trigger is gone. So this period of of calmer promotional activity can extend you know at least for another year because there's no reason for them to step up uh that intensity while this process is going on so it's gonna it'll likely remain this way at least for a year and then after that we'll see who buys the asset and so on but even if a new company buys that uh, entity it's not like they're going to start off uh you know firing out uh, huge promotions that's not the way to do it so at least on that front we are you know, the, the, the sector, uh, you know, has a good outlook. You, we don't see the kind of uh, elevated intensity that we saw in 19 and uh, most of 20. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more content like that, please consider subscribing or join me on my website, greggorner.com. That's greggorner.com. Look forward to seeing you there.